What's up, Grady T? Today I've got a sauce from a company that I've heard about uh, quite a bit through the Discord and Instagram and all that other good stuff. Uh, so this is Mike V's Garlic Scorpion. Showed a bottle there. This came from the uh, Hot Sauce of the Month Club. As far as I know, this is not Mike V, the skateboarder. This is some other Mike V, but it's a garlic sauce and through the discord everybody talks about different garlic sauces and ones that they like so i want to give it a whirl but what i thought was really cool is i don't know if the video will show too well but it's uh the consistency of it it's like it's got a lot of stuff in it but it's not very thick it's really cutting through that bottle so i bet when i go to pour it a lot more is going to come out than what I anticipate, but that's cool too. So, obviously, I'm not going to go through everything on the label, but your main ones, obviously, is your scorpion pepper, and then we got jalapeno, and what I assume is a ton of garlic, which is awesome. So, Mike V's out of Georgetown, Texas. Uh, bup, 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 bup. Hashtag Mike V's food, hashtag Mike V's garlic scorpion. So I'm sure if you punch those up on Instagram or, I don't know, maybe Twitter or something, that you can check out more. Or just check out Mike V's hot sauce, and I'm sure it'll pop up. So I'm going to give it a whirl. The label off. Ooh, that's garlic. I see it's got the wide mouth, so when you pour it, it's really going to come out. So I found these at the grocery store. You can kind of see what them are there. So it's called, uh, where's the paper at? There it is. I'm gonna pronounce it wrong, I think. Wow, Bao, B-A-O, which is a, uh, it says Mongolian style Bao, uh, spicy beef. I've had these before, they're delicious. Which is, uh, it's a steam bun filled with beef, vegetables, and garlic chili paste. So if we didn't have enough garlic going, we definitely got some. So this is the label. And if you see these at your at your grocery store or something, I really suggest picking them up. They're, they're real good. So I just thought instead of doing just the sauce, you know, I need to eat lunch. So let's put some food with it and uh, shake it up. And I'm going to pour a healthy amount. It's all over. It actually looks fresh. The way that it's, the way that the, the whatever you call it, the dumpling or uh, bun. Let me show. The way that it's it's formed, like the sauce drips down, it's kind of cool. Uh, how's that gonna work? Like that. And that fresh. That's kind of cool. All right. So I'm gonna dig in. Actually, you know what? Let me try just a little bit of the sauce by itself. A little bit of some vegetable mix in here. Ooh. Hmm. That scorpion boy, that hits right away. It's not overly powerful. Um, but it does it packs a kick. This is probably like a Oh, maybe like a, maybe a four, you know, four. It's good though. So anyway, I'm gonna dig in, try and uh, not be a pig on camera. I've seen a few times where I've messed up, chewed my mouth open, so I try not to do that. Hmm, talk about being a pig, drop some. You know, I think this was a good, uh, good combo with the scorpion pepper and the and the garlic going with these. I could definitely see this going with um, like a stir fry, or um, shit. Even if you picked up Chinese food, you know, like uh, fried rice, something like that. 
this would this would go together well and i really didn't plan to mix those two this was the next bottle up and this is what i had in the fridge for lunch it wasn't really planned but oh <laughs> they come on paper kind of got to peel that mess off make a little bit of a mess there but so this was just a um what did Bob Ross say? The happy accident? That's what this is, happy accident. This is really good, and I understand why people talk very highly about like these. Um, yeah, this is through Hot Sauce of the Month Club. I don't know the exact name. Maybe it's just called Hot Sauce of the Month, but if you Google Hot Sauce of the Month, it's probably going to be the same one that I do. Every month they send me a new one. And there's a cool little card, but it comes with it. But I have a um, a little book that I'll show one day. Anytime somebody sends me stickers or um, even a nice note with their hot sauce, I put it in the book. And all these little t these uh, little cards that come with the hot sauce, they go in the book too. So one day, maybe when we're up to like, I don't know, episode or video, whatever, like... 25 or 30 maybe by then it'll be enough to to show it off and i'll show through you know all the different stuff but uh this is um this is good yeah the heat register is about a four so it's not over the top but it definitely does it you know, dancing on the tongue man dancing on the tongue it um it's very good but it's not gonna melt it's not gonna melt your face off and um it's not, you know, too weak like uh, like a Tabasco or something. It's it's right in the middle. Yeah, I would use this for uh, like your Asian cuisines. This is my opinion, of course, but you watch the show for my opinion, or because well, I don't know why else you'd watch the show. So anyway, I'm uh, I'm gonna finish my lunch here, and uh, this was Mike V's garlic scorpion hot sauce. You guys have a good one. Be safe. See you now.